today I've got the kids what I've got them for Christmas 2023 video. We went Christmas shopping last Sunday and got all the kids stuff for Christmas and actually managed to get it in two shops um, which I was quite surprised that we were going to do a massive online order on Amazon um, and then we just thought let's take the kids shopping they got to have a little look at bits and tell us what they liked and we went to a garden centre so we just tied it in the kids have gone to the park with daddy and here's the giant baby here's the giant baby you didn't want to miss out did you oh you didn't want to miss out and we got you some presents didn't we why not you sit over there over there no you were asleep this could be hard with a labrador um so yeah i'm going to show you everything i've got for them the budget has increased a bit this year like most years um if you've watched my other ones i've spent about a hundred pound but obviously where they're getting a bit older and they like more expensive things and brands and names and just with how expensive things are we have increased a bit and i think between them they had on their toys about 150 pound which i don't think is bad and then i got them some outfits which i'll show you at the end but i haven't got their pajamas yet i'm gonna get them some christmas pajamas and need to do their stocking fillers but i will do their stocking fillers and their christmas eve boxes on another video for you to see so let's start the video what are you chewing bloody dog so their first thing i've got them this is a joint present now, i've never done a joint present but growing up we always because there was six of us growing up um, and I had like lots of siblings. Um, my mum used to sometimes get us a joint present. So like one year we had a a Wii, like the old Nintendo, like the Nintendo, and then another year we had a karaoke, like me and my sister to share. And it was actually really fun, like just having something to share, like which is quite hard. Um, but yeah, we just loved it. So I thought I'd get them this um, Tony's box. I've wanted to get them one for ages. Nair keeps seeing them on YouTube and stuff and a few of her friends have got them and I just thought it'd be nice for Odie to obviously have it as well because they do share a room at the minute like this is Odin's bedroom but he will not sleep in it so um they can listen to it together and then eventually maybe one day um I'll get another one second hand or something like if Odin obviously ever comes in here on his own and I'm going to get them like a little shelf eventually to put all their little figures on and then when it's other birthdays and Christmas I can just say to family get them a little character instead of giant toys um so yeah this uh reads stories and tells songs I think um yeah it's basically just like stories I think um I'm not too sure um but I will do a review of it when um I set it up. I think I'm going to charge it and set it up before Christmas Day. Um, so, yeah. But it does say age three plus, but Odie is nearly three. So that is their joint present. And I got them two figures, and that was £100 in Argos. Um, there's obviously a lot more bundles online and on Black Friday sales, but I just got this at the time because that was the deal. So, yeah, love it. And um, Nair wanted blue, and I thought blue is neutral for both of them. So I think it's gonna be a great present. Moving on to Naya's bit. So that's their joint present. Um, and then Naya picked the Peppa Pig Bedtime Stories one as her Tony's character. So that will go in her little Santa sack and I'm just gonna put that in the middle of their presents. Um, so she picked that one because she thought it'd be quite nice to listen to some bedtime stories. And then my sister has got them a character each and one to share. So they're gonna have five, yeah, five characters on Christmas, which would be really nice. Um, and then I got Naya this kinetic sand. She's obsessed with ice cream and making like things like that. This is an ice cream like waffle kit and it comes with the sand and it smells. That's quite cool. This was only £11. So she will love that. She wanted the slime, but I thought she's had loads of slime and it ends up just going minging and getting bin. So I thought we'll try kinetic sand. Picked this one in B&M. This was on the two for £24 deal and there was nothing else she wanted in this deal so we mix and matched it with one of Odie's so they actually got a, I got two presents for £12 um this is a pregnant Barbie <laughs> don't ask like she has a full-on bump like um, it's an actual like pregnant bump but Naya just loves anything mummy related it comes with a little cot 
a little another crib i think it's got a pram it's got like all the little essential things they need for the baby and it's got a mum and a dad and she doesn't have a dad yet it's not an actual barbie it's their b&m's brand called tiffany's world but we've had a few like fake barbies and they've actually been fine everyone said to me last year oh the fake barbies will last two minutes they'll break but they're not i personally don't think they're not much different to normal barbies um like these seem pretty good and in all fairness our barbies a few of them have only just died a year later because winnie's chewed their hands and feet off um so yeah so that's her little barbie set she picked and then to go with her barbies she also picked this ooh, camper looking thing it's like an suv car and it comes with a drum kit seats popcorn phones comes of all sorts i don't think any barbies actually come in it but like i said she's got loads of barbies so um that doesn't actually matter comes with 25 pieces so that will be fine she will love that that was 30 pound which i don't think is too bad she's got the massive lol camper and she got the barbie plane last year from her nanny so she wanted this one and it's not too big but she generally does play with these things every single day um so that's her biggish present that she picked so that was 30 pound in BM. and then she picked this pooping puppies toy <laughs> winnie so that was 11 pound it was actually on sale and it comes with a puppy you can feed it and it poops and makes sounds and something pops out its bum and it wears a nappy really random but naya loves stuff like this i think all kids do um and there's three to collect so she could always get more if she ever gets any money or it's another birthday and she likes keeping these big egg things to store her toys in um, so I thought it was quite cool. So yeah, that was £11, I think. I got her this little gun. This was three, four pounds I believe. They both wanted Nerf guns, but I don't want the giant ones. Um, so we got them one of these each and some refillable bullets. And they can just play with them. And they won't argue because they have one each. Headphone set. These are wireless and they are Barbie. They were £16 and she would just love them. She did have some headphones last year from her auntie. But the wire broke um so that's why we thought we'd go for headless this time what headless wireless oh my god my brain's not working um but she generally will use these like she used them when we went to greece she'll use them like when she's chilling and if she just wants a bit of quiet time um just if we're in the car and we've got the music on it's just yeah they're so handy great present her this color and style unicorn it's like a color your own do its hair round me thing um so yeah they were all her bits it doesn't look like a lot but see it's quite big things um and that was i'm pretty sure that was all 150 pound 50 80 i'll add up at the end but she also got this present so i'm not actually counting this in the budget i had a um referral code from my beagle street life insurance and i actually had two people use my referral code so i had 55 pounds free amazon voucher um so i got them both a present with that and it's like an extra present but obviously i didn't pay for it so um it's just an extra present to go in their things but naya wanted a camera so i was going to get her the is it vtech camera but i just thought oh, it's a lot of money and all it does is take pictures so i got her this phone and her cousins just got a phone and I, like, it doesn't do anything like a phone would but it like like texting and stuff but you can take photos you can play games you can do videos it's got a light a calendar a stopwatch an alarm and i just thought and music i just thought it'd be really i think you put headphones in it she might be able to connect her barbie ones i'm not sure i might i don't know um but i just thought it was a really cool little phone for her it's almost like a mini ipad but without like youtube and stuff and she will just love that she will think she is so grown up and so cool with her little phone and it was only, I think it was £25 on Amazon when I got it, but I will link it below. But if you watch the videos of what it does, it is so cool um, for how much it is. And it was obviously cheaper than the VTech camera and the VTech phone, because um, VTech do do a phone, but it's just an Amazon one. So that's her little extra present. 
so I think she will love that. And obviously Odie's got his Tony's box as well, like Naya, and he has got the Tony's Rocky Paw Patrol character. He is obsessed with Paw Patrol, obsessed. Like we've, we're still in the tractor digger era. Like that's his thing. That's his, always been his number one from age one, but Paw Patrol is like our new obsession um, and he loves it. So yeah, he's got this Rocky character. So here's Tony's one. And my sister's got him the chase character, so he will love that. Um, and he's obviously got a gun as well, which was four, three, four pounds. And I have got them a pack of refillables that I've kept in the kitchen drawer for Christmas Day. So I can just imagine all these bullets will get chewed by the dog or lost or something. And the refillables were like two pound. We've got him this giant kinetic sand one. This was 22 pound, but it's a carry case. It opens up. Um, and it comes with like a digger, you can make like brick shapes, a crane, he will love this, like he really likes Play-Doh and diggers and he will love it. And then on the two for £24 deal we got obviously Nair the Barbie and then we mixed and matched it with this, we've got him his first little tool set, he has got a few little tools that my sister got him, I think when he was one or two who I can't remember but he is obsessed with tools loves tools we were going to get him a tool table but he just obviously took up a lot of space and we just thought this can go in the tool uh, the tool the, la, 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 the toy box <laughs> um with all his bits and it comes with a cool little case and all the tools that daddy has apparently so um he will love that Duplo set uh the recycling one i'm gonna get him the digger one for his birthday because he loves duplo he's got the big duplo train and he just loves it plays it all the time and he is obsessed with bin trucks like it's not actually normal i think he's gonna probably be a bin man he loves bin trucks so much um so this one comes with the bin truck and it comes with little bins and like which one goes in which a little brush a recycling man a dog um, and this was down to £16 on Amazon and it is on offer at the moment because of Black Friday so it's definitely worth it because Duplo lasts, it doesn't break. Um, so at age two, 18 months I'd say from, he started playing with the Duplo from about 18 months is such a good present idea um, so we definitely, he will love this 100%. And like Vinaya, I also have the other part of my voucher. So they have like £25 each on my Amazon voucher. So I got Odie this track. It's like a, <clears throat> I think, I want to say it's electrical. I don't know. <laughs> I imagine it is. If it's not, it doesn't matter. I think they just go around actually. I don't think it's electrical. But he could even put his, his motorised Thomas's on it. Um... And yeah, he just loves diggers and it's like a digger track basically. And he will love that. Just thought it was a great little present. Got Odie some Play-Doh. This was down to five pound on Amazon. So I ordered the Duplo and that from Amazon um, for Odie. This was, yeah, five pound. He loves Play-Doh, so just a big pack. We had loads and he mixed them all and lost them all and broke them all like just dried up and so yeah, Play-Doh is just one of the things where eventually it does get bin. So I got him that. So all oh, these little bits there. And then his looks like he might have more than Naya, but he has got a Paw Patrol bundle, which I got off Amazon, uh, Amazon or Facebook Marketplace for £30. Obviously, if you've been on my channel for a while, you will know that I love to try and get a bargain. And I like buying things secondhand for kids because it just it helps someone else out it's better for the planet and it's better for my bank account basically if i was to buy all this paw patrol stuff brand new it would have been Odie's whole christmas present he'd have nothing else um and yeah and the little boy who i bought this off from the family he was about eight and he was so excited with his 30 pounds that i gave him and like he basically could go buy something new and Odie got a whole bundle and it's so well looked after um, so I got him this lookout tower. Um, he's going to love this. It's not the biggest one, but see, he can maybe get that eventually secondhand, the big, big one. Um, we'll see how he gets on with this one. So I got him this tower and it comes with all the little cars. <laughs> uh, the little metally ones. So I got all of them with it. I got the plane, which he will love. Um, 
Oh my god. Um a massive I've got that plain stone off now. Oh, what is this? Um this like opens up a big chase vehicle. Obviously, the only difference with like things you buy in marketplace is sometimes the stickers are a tiny bit faded. But what child on Christmas Day is going to open and be like, oh, the sticker's a bit faded. I don't like that. He's not going to give a damn. Um, and then it's come with, we've got Sky, we've got, is it Zuma? I don't even know his bloody name. We've got Rocky, Rubble, Marshall Fire Truck he already has. It's not actually in here. Um, but he has got the big Marshall fire truck. It's got another rock, uh, rubble, like bulldozer y looking one. And it's got another chase one. Um, and another chase one. And then we've got Ryder on his little bike. And then we've got all of the figures and loads of the little metal cars for the tower. So that whole, like, there's loads. There's a whole box of that. £30 for that massive bundle. I was so happy. Like, he he has a, an amazing present now he's gonna love it um so it doesn't look like they have a lot and i like when i looked at it i had like this immediate pressure i was like oh my god it looks like they have nothing um and i was like i'm gonna have to go buy more but if i go buy them more then i'm gonna be spending like another hundred pound and they don't need it like they have so many toys they're gonna be so happy with these things and then they've obviously got my sisters my um dad like my mum like Shane's family, everyone's presents all together is just ridiculous. They do not need that much stuff. So I'm ha so happy with all the bits that I've got. I will put like a little clip at the end of all the bits and I will try and link what I can below. But yeah, I'm super impressed with all the bits that I got. Hope you enjoyed. And um can't remember what I was going to say. My brain's really not working today. Um... I don't know <laughs> but I will record a Christmas stocking video and a Christmas Eve box one and I'm going to do a little short on my Instagram shorts a real thing of all the bits I got Winnie because I don't really want to make a video of just the dog's Christmas presents because it's not enough to make a actual video um but yeah that's all the bits that I got them and I'm really looking forward to Christmas we're going to put our tree up next week few days before December I'm gonna cheat this year because I'm just so excited to put up um but yeah look out for lots more Christmassy content to come and I hope you have a lovely day goodbye so this is all their bits this is like the bundle um these are actually he's got two of these downstairs so I'm gonna give these to someone else just so they can have them because he's got these two downstairs and he's got another rubble downstairs and he's got two fire trucks downstairs so I've just given him all these bits um in it but that was 30 pound for that bundle and obviously there was like four other big things but obviously we've got like duplicates of them Odie Sand his character and his bits and then all Nair's bits and then obviously that's their thing but they've had equal amounts Odie just looks like a tiny bit more because he's got this whole set I got this big box from B&M. It was £3, I think. Um, and it stores all the Paw Patrol stuff. So if you're getting a second-hand present um, for your child, then get a big gift box like that to keep all the bits in because obviously it doesn't come in packaging. And then I will just wrap that in his big Santa sack.